I actually just signed a PTO with a team in the Federal Prospects League um, in Blue Ridge, Virginia, and I was actually just there on Friday, and Skyler got me in contact with Coach, and he was looking for another goalie uh, for training camp, so he got me in contact with him, and uh, he offered me to come uh, take a spot here, and that's just an opportunity you can't pass up, especially being local, but even at this level, no matter what team it is, it's, uh, it's a blessing. For sure, and I'm sure you uh, went to your fair share of Comets games growing up. Just uh, what does this opportunity mean to you just to suit up for your hometown team? It's surreal. You know, since I got home, uh, just going to the meeting last night, being around these guys, it's so it's professional. The professionalism is crazy. Um, I had season tickets growing up the entire time, you know, entire time before I could walk. Um, up in 321, I'd, I'd watch uh, Kevin St. Pierre, and now I'm wearing 31 out here. It's the craziest thing I could have ever imagine. I'm just super blessed that they're giving me this opportunity. Just uh, what, what do you hope to uh, check off this next week as you uh, prove, as you uh, look to uh, make this uh, final roster? Just the experience, you know, uh, being around the being around the guys, being around the, the skill level is crazy, and uh, just proving to myself that I belong to be here. You know, I deserve to be here. I'm starting out my professional career as well, whether it's here or not. Um, just the experience will go a long way. You you look at the other goalies in this room. You got a guy like Francois who was one goalie of the year in the ECHL. How can you uh, rely on uh, some of these other guys who have uh, been playing at the ECHL level for uh, a few years now? Yeah, these guys are the real deal. You know, I, I already had a, a time uh, earlier to pick their brain, so it was, uh, it was a good time just being able to hear what they have to say, what to expect, and uh, hopefully get to that level at some point in my career. Was St. Pierre a big influence for you as a young goalie? He was, yeah. I was actually a player for the longest time, and then I watched Kevin St. Pierre make that crazy paddle save years and years ago, and I was in 321, so right above his net when he made that save, and I was like, that's what I want to do. And then I uh, ended up getting a private session with him, uh, just being in goalie skates and like rental goalie pads. And ever since I met him, it was, I want to be a goalie. So, so what age would you have been when that happened if you were? I started playing around when I was three or four. I started goalie when I was about six.